OpenAI just released a brand new feature for ChatGPT called Turbo Mode. In this video, we're going to be answering some of the most frequently asked questions about this new feature. Things like, what is Turbo Mode? How do you use it? Is it worth it? And can you get this on the free plan? All right, let's jump into it. So Turbo Mode is a new feature from OpenAI that basically allows you to switch between two different versions of ChatGPT. You're going to have the standard model and a version that's optimized for speed. Now, the way that Turbo Mode works is that you simply go to the top of your page and you will see a drop down option here. You have Standard Plus, Turbo Plus. Now, the standard mode is the normal chat GPT model. This is the one that you're used to using all the time. Now you have Turbo Mode as an option, which is going to be optimized for speed. So currently, this is an alpha status. This is an alpha feature. So it might have bugs. It might have issues with it. Right now, they're just rolling it out letting people try it, test it out to see how it works. So what we're going to do is give ChatGPT two identical prompts and just see how each mode performs. We're going to try it in the default mode and we're going to try it in the turbo mode. So the first thing that we're going to try is the default mode. So I'm just going to put in a prompt that asks, does Google care how long your articles are? Explain in detail. So if I paste it here, I'm going to put a, I'm going to pull up the clock and just so you can see in real time how long it takes. So it was at the 10 second mark. All right, so it just finished. So that took about 20 seconds, I would say. About 20 seconds to get that response. So now what I'm going to do is do the same exact thing, but for the turbo mode. Now, one important thing to note is that once you've started a mode, you can't switch it from here. So if I click on plus or any of this, it does not let you switch from the, the uh, default mode to the turbo mode at all. So you're going to have to create a brand new chat and we're just going to switch the modes right now to turbo. And we're going to paste in the exact same prompt. I'm going to pull up the clock right now. So it was on the 12 second mark. All right, done. So 34 seconds. So from 12 second to 34 second. Honestly, I don't really see that much of a speed improvement. This is just initial testing. But if you're getting like super hyped about this, I probably wouldn't just because at least in the first initial rollout, I'm not really seeing that big of a difference, maybe one or two seconds. But in the grand scheme of it all, if you're on the premium plus plan, you already have a faster output than the free users do. So I really don't see a huge difference or benefit right now. I'm going to play around with it a little bit more and maybe do an update video. But right now, not really that big of an improvement. As of right now, Turbo Mode is only available to users on ChatGPT Plus plan. If we take a look at the release notes for the February 9th version of ChatGPT, OpenAI clearly states that depending upon the feedback, they may roll out this feature to all users coming soon. Now, this is going to be something that probably won't happen in a week or a month, but they're going to test the waters to see how well the feature works. Now, if you want to be updated when OpenAI and ChatGPT roll out some brand new features, some cool news from the company, then make sure you hit that subscribe button, give this video a like and turn on notifications because we're going to have way more content like this as soon as it's announced.